Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at more of my favorite full-size 9mm. A couple weeks ago I limited myself to five full-size 9mm and I thought to myself, man I missed so many. Plus you guys called me out pretty good. I stand by the five that I featured. It was a CZ75 SP01, a Grand Power X Caliber, Springfield XDM Elite 4.5 inch barrel, a Breda 92X Performance, and a Walther PDP, those were my five, but I thought about it and I got called out and so I brought out some more. Here is my Sig Sauer P226 Talo exclusive. Beautiful handgun, PVD coated frame. It's an ASC alloy stainless elite, the 4.4 inch barrel, Sig Light night sights, beautiful rosewood grips. It's a Talo exclusive. A limited edition 18 round mags come standard with 15 this is a mechgar with a plus two base plate and a little bit longer and an srt trigger very short reset trigger check this out right there amazing let's take a few shots and show off this beautiful hand all right the P226 model has been around for years. People love them, I love them, and this one is very special to me. Here's my Magnum Research Baby Desert Eagle 3 all steel model. They also make this with a polymer frame. This is all steel with a 4.4 inch barrel. Full rail there, 15 round mags. It will accept the CZ75 larger mags. Double action, single action. You can see there it does have a Slide mounted thumb safety decocker, they call that a teardrop, and it is ambidextrous. That will put the gun in safe mode. A very nice shooting handgun, single action, very nice, three dot metal sights. And together, a great package for those who like all steel guns. This thing has been great. I've owned it for a while. I also have the 45 model. Let's see here. Yeah, what a nice handgun this is. Baby Desert Eagle 3. They, they actually slimmed down the grip from the Baby Desert Eagle 2, and it does have a great ergonomic feel. Here's my Canik TP9 SFX, full-size race gun that offers a lot in the case. Additional back straps, 20 round magazines, tungsten gray finish, a trigger that is amazing. Breaks right around four pounds. The short reset. Canik says you can purchase this gun and go compete immediately. It is optic ready there. It does have adjustable rear sights, fiber optic front sights, lightning cuts in the slide, front serrations, comes with a holster, easy takedown, disassemble. It even has different magazine release heights. You can change it out. I know I'm missing a lot. They they offer a ton, and this is, this has been a great gun. A lot of people love it. Priced right and it sure does offer a lot. Those who love optic ready handguns, this one is a very popular choice. Let's go here. All right. Yep, it's always fired excellent. The TP9 SFX race gun, and I've owned it for about four years now, and it is still in perfect condition. I really love what Bursa did with the TPR models. Here's a full size TPR 9 with a four and a quarter inch barrel, 17 round mags, loaded with features. It is a double action, single action, but I want to focus on that reset. Check that out. Just as short as the SIG SRT trigger. Excellent job, Bursa. Ambidextrous slide stop, easiest takedown you've ever seen in your life. Aluminum frame, three dot sights, AR6 hour interchangeable, a rail, and an amazing trigger pull with 17 round mags. I think they did an amazing job. Let's take a few shots here. I've always liked this. They make this in a subcompact model. This is the full size with the four and a quarter inch barrel. And I think Bursa 
hit it out of the park and it became quite popular as well. Here is another competition gun called the Ruger American Competition. They came out with this approximately a year and a half ago. I love the American line. I've often said that when Ruger came out with the American semi-auto pistols that that was the best they've ever created. And I stand by that. Now here's the competition model. It does have ambidextrous controls, both slide stop and magazine release, 17 round mags. They made it optic ready, adjustable rear sights, green fiber optic front sight, lightning cuts in the slide, five inch barrel, full rail, same trigger that we're used to with the American series. Breaks around five and a quarter, five and a half pounds right there. Full size American and I love the American series. And I think they did a great job with this pistol. Yes. Ruger Americans. Very nice. And I really like this full-size model. So there are five more full-size 9mm handguns that I love. I hope you guys appreciate what I have. Let me know what you have. And I certainly hope you enjoyed the video. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.